Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Marisa. So in this video, I am going to be doing a huge Christmas haul. So let's get started. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a haul from Michael's, uh, The Dollar Tree, and Tonic Studios, and it's also a project share. So it's a long one, so let's get started. Hey guys, so this is from The Dollar Tree. I got this very, very pretty cup. I just love it. I got that for myself. And what is next? Yes, I got a lot of decorative shred because I was making some uh, baskets for Christmas gifts this year. And then I got this cute little guy for myself. It is so cute. It's like a little penguin box. So adorable. And I have a lot of my facial products in there. So it's kind of an idea for you guys if you want an idea for storage or something like that. And the whole thing is a dollar, literally. It's so adorable. Okay. Oops. It was a little heavy. So I got these cute little trees here. And I got um, two sets. One in white and one in green. And the big, so the smaller one in the green one I used to make this. And this is a little craft jar bottle. And I'm not using it for like craft storage. I'm using it to make these cute little trees. And it's kind of like a snow globe. I put some fake snow in there. It was so simple to make. It's just a cute little idea for decorations. And yes, I got these very nice uh, ribbon I could use in my craft projects or for gifts. And this one says Believe. Yeah, this is all from the Dollar Tree. Really, really nice. So I love those. And, yeah, and I got one more of those, the ornaments, you could DIY it, uh, the plastic ornaments, I'll probably have a lot for next year, quite frankly, and I just got some adhesive dots from Crafter Square, and then I got some more glue dots from, uh, what brand is that, I guess it's glue dots, and then I got these cool, um, wood dowels, but this time I got the longer ones, so I can make some wands, or maybe some other projects, I have the smaller version of those. So let me move those out of the way. And up next, I got these cute little wooden bells. I could actually use them year round, quite frankly, not just for Christmas. But this guy is a cute little wooden Santa. You can use it for a napkin holder or a pencil holder or something like that. And I got a cute little snowman. And that's all for the Dollar Tree. Next up is stickers from Michaels. All right, first, I'm going to do a Tonic Studios haul. This is a very uh, small haul. It's a layering die set I'm going to use for card making. And uh, this is the oval one, and I got a really, really great price. I only paid like $17 for, for the whole set to have these sales every Wednesday. And I am waiting for some other stuff from them. They've just really, really, really backed up this year. I almost waited a month for those. <clears throat> Sorry. So first is some stickle stickers, <laughs> stickles, from my collection. These cute little elf feet. I love those. And I got two of these. I got uh, little candy stickers. They're so adorable. And everything was 50% off. So any price you see, it's 50% off. And I got some candy canes. Again, like if those are $3, it was $1.50. I got two of these. I love the little trucks. Um, with the uh, Christmas trees in them. I thought it was really, really cute. And I got some Santa hats. Very adorable. I'm going to have so much for next year. And I got two of these, the little stockings. Yeah, you know, I would suggest um, if they have sales, you grab it because everything's probably going to be 50% off or more and you can get, use it for next year, you know? So this is also a project share. So this is what I made. This is the Crystal Blue Collection from Recollections from Michaels. 
I'm just gonna do some quick flip throughs of the paper pads I got it's very pretty just icy I love that paper but actually out of all the papers I got um, this is my least favorite of the group but I still like it I think some of the pages are really pretty yeah merry and bright there's like the crystal blue so again that was 50% off and this is what I made with it these uh, huge tag cards instead of just making cards or just tags I made it like a card a huge tag card and I used that little blue flower there I got at my local uh, discount store this one is one of my favorite collections the safe freeze I got the 12 by 12 paper pad which I used a lot of so if you see some scraps please forgive me I couldn't wait and I got the six by six so it's pretty much the same this beautiful little cut aparts here I had to get the smaller one too because I really fell in love with it just I love the colors it's like red and pinks and greens so pretty so many cut aparts you can use and that beautiful red truck in the night sky just, I, I just love this collection. I don't know what about it is. It's like very cheery. More cut aparts, like these mini tags. And I love that there's snow place like home. Yeah, this is actually one of my favorite uh, collections for Christmas. I love that little snowman and I made some really cool things with it. I'm going to show you soon. And that's actually one of my favorite pages as well. The little hot cocoa cups. And that's the backs of some of them. It's like, it, these are double-sided. This pad is double-sided, the 6x6. Six six. The 12x12 12 12 is not. So here's, <laughs> I just went deep into this, using this um, paper pad. I just love it. So it's pretty much the same Sorry about all the scraps, but as you can see, I used it. I just really fell in love with it. So it's pretty much the same as the 6x6. Six six. I just love it. It's so pretty. Again, very, very cheery. And see all the scraps I already have. I just really love it. And I'm so happy I found this collection. Holly Jolly and more scraps. Because you get to see what I made in a second so that's another paper pad i'm going to show you in a minute so again i made these huge tag cards and look how pretty this is just very very nice and i added some dimension to them using the little foam tape the pop dots and i used a lot of um washi tape on the edges to make it a nice clean edge there and that I actually found that lacy tape on the bottom from a local uh, discount store it's a lacy cotton tape so pretty holly jolly and I actually made this one too um, that trim is from beadcraft chick I believe yeah this is just a really uplifting cheerful uh, paper pack I just fell in love with it so that's what I made with that one. So let's get move that out of the way. And this just came. Um, this one just came today, I believe. And this is wrapped with care uh, collection. And I really love this one too. And this, I believe, this is also either. I believe it was 50% off. Originally it was like $20.19.99 plus tax. And I got it for like $11. So this is a really nice paper pack too. Sorry about the um, shadows. I'm trying to get rid of them and give you a better angle here. All right. Well, there's going to be a little shadow. Sorry about that. These cutter parts are so beautiful. Look at beautiful papers just gorgeous more cut aparts just so pretty home for the holidays just really really nice look at those gorgeous they're just so pretty these cut aparts
I love that page again. I love that. It's like a pinky red. Just very, very nice. Holly Jolly. I love that one. You can just like write little notes to yourself. I love that. The trees. I found some really nice uh, paper pads this year. This is actually my first Christmas doing uh, paper crafting. So I didn't have a lot in that beautiful, cool red truck with the tree. That was like a theme this year for no matter where I went. I saw that that red truck with the Christmas tree. So I'm glad I found that. This one is so beautiful as well. This is the Sugar Plum collection. And I'm sure a lot of you guys have these, uh, these collections already. But again, my first Christmas doing paper crafting. So I love this. So, uh, you know, very, very pink, very feminine. The other one was a, could be a little more masculine. So I like to have both. So these color parts are just gorgeous. The ornaments, sparkly ornaments. These color parts are absolutely gorgeous. And that's one of my favorite pages with the churches and the homes. Then you have the foil pages. So pretty. Just gorgeous. Look how beautiful that is. I don't know how they do that, but it's just so pretty. <laughs> I just love it. I'm literally addicted to paper pads so beautiful yeah I literally can't st stop buying paper pads see all the I already made some stuff more cut aparts just so pretty yeah especially when they're on sale I go in so uh, I love that I just like having different and more foil uh, pages yeah, I really like the pink, uh, Christmassy, you know, winter feel to it. I just love that. All right. Okay, so this is what I made. I made a few cards. If I can open it. <laughs> so that's the front and that's the inside. I use a little Tonic Studios uh, mousse on that page for the background. And those cute little gingerbread men. And I use some uh, glitter from tonic as well and then I used those um, dies I just got for the card so I could layer them so I really really just went in on using that immediately and here is another card snow bless with that pretty little pink cup and then there's that sticker there with the uh, truck and the tree so that's what I made so far with that paper pad. And I believe this is the last paper pad that I got, White Christmas. This one, I just, uh, so I took all, again, I used it already. Sorry guys, but here's some of the cut aparts and the scraps already. This is really a beautiful, absolutely gorgeous paper pad. I am so happy I found it. Let's move the scraps out of the way so I can actually show you the pad look at that look how beautiful that is whoever designed this is a genius really acorns and that's like a glittery page that it's not coming through on the video so well but that was a glittery uh, page Merry Christmas Buffalo check that's one of my favorite pages so beautiful that has some texture to it, some trees. Those are some some of the cut aparts. Yeah, those match my stickers, so that's just beautiful. So I will have plenty for next year, so I won't have to buy that much. Yes, yeah, so lovely. Some wreaths, very pretty. So that is that paper pad. And this is what I made with them. So I put some foam, that little lace uh, tape, added some 3D elements to it. Happy holidays and happy holidays to everyone out there. And that is a textured page there. And there is, I love that one page. This is plain gray and white and has a really nice texture to it. And this is really beautiful. Merry and bright Christmas night. 
and then here's that glittery uh, page. Now it's coming through a little bit better. And I actually used that other paper pad, Believe, Believing is Seeing. I actually mixed the collections together. So that is it, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching today. I wish everyone a very happy holiday. Merry Christmas, whatever you, ever you celebrate. I just really wish you a Merry Christmas and Happy Holiday. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. The wonders of life got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light. I am right where I want to be. I'll be home for a couple of days, wander around with you. You and me in the cold, thought it'd never be true. Wherever I go, I got you. Oh, I have stopped running, there is no way trying. You better loosen your belt. Drinking up wine by the fire. Don't care of anything else. It's Christmas. And some kind of love, my friend. I pray it will never end. Do you like to be here too? It's Christmas. And outside snow's glistening. Just you and me tonight I'll spend all this Christmas with you Oh, it's such a charm Got you up in my arm There's nobody at the door You said I wish this will never be over Darling, it's time for your present Come over here Now it is time to get out in the snow Lighting 